Checking back in now with meteorologist Michael Sager, who is who's tracking another record temperature breaking day. I mean, it's been crazy. Yeah, well, yesterday 84 degrees for the high broke a record for the date, which was 81 previously. And today's record high is also 81 degrees, but we are going to pass that this afternoon, forecasting a high of 86 degrees this afternoon. It is going to be a very warm day. We'll have a pretty good breeze out of the west southwest as well. Unfortunately, with that wind and the dry air that we've got in place, the fire risk is going to be extremely high today, so please no outdoor burning. But you can see our temperatures, they'll be warming up quickly through the morning hours. I've got us in the low 80s already by noon, and then 86 degrees for that high. And again, those winds 15 to 30 miles per hour. Wind advisory is in effect today through very early tomorrow morning too. So we've got the wind and the dry air in place, and there's our fire risk. It'll be highest across north and western portions of the region, a little lower for those of you south and east, but still, that being said it is going to be fairly high across the board just much higher farther north and west so again no outdoor burning just don't take that chance today and believe it or not this is the time of year when we typically uh, see that peak in our fire potential where the grass is still dormant and sometimes we sneak in these warm and windy days late february and early march and it can really put an uptick in that fire risk and that's exactly what we're going to see today but those temperatures today will be at record levels for the date by several degrees a lot of us will be climbing well up into the mid 80s this afternoon for those highs and then the cold front's going to come in tonight so if you have plans to be out this evening don't get caught off guard notice our temperature i've got us at 77 degrees at seven o'clock this evening this is for tulsa it might be getting a little cooler already up along the oklahoma and kansas line by seven or eight o'clock because that front's going to affect you first and then notice nine o'clock 57 into the 40s by 10 o'clock with a strong north wind so by 10 o'clock tonight that front's going to start to sweep on through in those temperatures will be dropping not just the temperatures dropping but the wind chills as well look at this into tomorrow morning forecast wind chill values down into the teens to low 20s so we're waking up this morning with some of us into the 60s we'll have highs well into the 80s this afternoon but by tomorrow morning Oh yeah, we're going to be reaching for the coats. It's going to be cold and blustery. Nice and comfortable though right now as we look here on the Wade's RV Weather Camera Network from Brookside back toward downtown Tulsa. Mostly clear skies at the moment. A few high level clouds are going to mix through today. And then here comes that cold front again sweeping through tonight, turning much colder behind this front into tomorrow morning. High pressure will settle in. We'll enjoy some sunshine tomorrow, but it will be noticeably chillier for tomorrow. Now if your plans take you north and east, there will be severe storm potential across parts of Illinois and Indiana. Indiana today and into tonight. We do not have to worry about that here and we do have a chance of rain though. Not very heavy, but maybe a few showers by Thursday afternoon into Thursday night as a weak upper level system will be sweeping throughout that time. So we'll kind of keep it chilly tomorrow and Thursday, but then a quick warm up weekend plans will be good to go back near 80 on Sunday.